it's Bunny, and it's time for yet another riveting journey into world's weirdest. And today we're going to be exploring the world's weirdest Halloween costumes and masks. Masks are like a bonus. It's mostly costumes. Really quick before we get into today's video, I would like to give a quick shout out and a thank you to today's sponsors, which is Game Loft. Uh, and the game is Dragon Mania Legends. You guys may remember me talking about this game about four months ago. I think it was in my $10 Walmart challenge, but I had recommended this game to you guys and I have still been playing it all of these months later. You can collect over 200 different types of dragons. Dragons like Banana dragon, lava dragon, candy dragon, tiger dragon, and a ton more dragons. There's lots of dragons in this game. If you love dragons, this is your game. So not only do you collect them, but you can also train with them and battle with other people all over the world. You can battle with anybody, anybody else that has the game, that is. You can even build your own dragon island in the game so that your dragon family has a home for themselves. I have been playing it constantly over these past couple months and you should definitely check it out. If you want to download it, it is free. You can get it on iOS, Android, and Windows. Once again, the game is Dragon Mania Legends and it is a free download. So really you have nothing to lose if you're looking for a new game. I know in some parts of the world, the weather is getting kind of chillier. So maybe you're just sitting inside crashing on your couch. You want to play a game. I definitely recommend that you check this one out. So the link to get it for free will be in the info box. It's going to be the very first link and you can just click on that and you can download it for yourself. And I'm back on a different day. Uh, so my camera died right after I filmed yesterday's video intro. Of course it did, because I'm the least prepared person on the planet. So here we are today on a different day with world's weirdest, where <laughs> there's a T at the end of the word, world's weirdest costumes and masks. It's like how yesterday I couldn't say out for the day. What's that point there? We're gonna do masks first, because there's only three of them. Also, I'm in a place today where I can twirl and jump and rope. It's somewhere different. We'll talk about that later. The first mask that I have, I don't, okay, so it's called the Clumsy Cook Mask. So just imagine, if you will, what that could possibly mean, and then we'll see if your guess is right or not. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go down here and I'm gonna put the mask on, okay. Would you ever imagine clumsy cook mask means you somehow shoved your head into a chicken or a turkey? Is this a turkey? Is this a chicken? Is this a turkey? Is it a chicken? I don't know, but I'm gonna tell you guys right now, the visuals, I can barely see you, but I do have a turkey head. All right, mask number one. Done. On to mask number two, which I can identify with this mask. It is perfectly fitting for my life. It's when you want to be actual trash. For days when you feel like literal trash, you can just throw this on and just go about your day, you know? Na, 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 na. It smells very rubbery in here though. I just want to let you guys know that. Also, the cool thing about this mask is the the whole, I mean, you can't see and talk, but like, blah, there's a, there's a mouth hole big enough where people could like maybe feed you snacks if you were at a Halloween party. Yes. Yes. It's so beautiful. Um, ew, I just poked myself in the actual eye. Don't do that at home. I really like this one, but just a critique, okay? Whoever made this. Don't you guys think that it could have been improved slightly if they would have made the trash like a distinctively different color than the can? Who has silver trash? Nobody! Time for the final mask. And you guys are never gonna believe what this is. Also tell me, is the, is the lighting crazy in here? Is it too harsh? Is it just right? It's burning my retinas, but I will burn my retinas for the Swamp Family because that's how much I love you guys! Also, I'm a giant toilet! I kind of didn't 
realize how gross and disgusting this is on more levels, more than one level, right? Um, it's very foamy, but here I am, toilet head. But there's even a lever, you know, you can like, you can flush yourself. <sighs> Too bad that doesn't actually move, but you can kind of wiggle your finger in there and do some flushing. <laughs> Costumes. Okay, so first up, we have an actual giant foot. Big, giant, foamy foot. Who came up with this? Who's like, yeah, I want to be a foot for Halloween. Oh, you guys. Look at this. Even the toes are hairy. The toes are hairy. Let's look at that. Why? Why? Of course, I guess my toes are hairy. So. You know, fair game. You're gonna have to leave me a comment down below and let me know, like, have you ever had friends that have bought any of these costumes? Have you ever worn any of these costumes? Are you gonna confess that you were a giant foot in the comments down below? I don't know. Um, I mean, I'm just, like, I'm surprised to see some things get manufactured, you know? Look at this. I can't even fit it all in one frame. Sometimes I wish we could film in uh, vertical, but you know, that's for like YouTube newbies, I guess. People, people who don't do the uploading. You know, from back here, it doesn't look like a big giant foot. Do I look like a big giant foot to you? I don't know. I'm a big giant foot, I'm a big giant foot, I'm a big giant foot. They should have painted the toenails. on planet earth we've got the uh wacky wiggler aka inflatable wacky arm tube man i swear one day i will find one of these i will buy one and i'm just gonna set it up in my front lawn oh my gosh there's like even a little hat in here that you get to put on can you guys see this let me get a little bit closer okay um there's a hat and i'm putting my nose in it because clearly I don't know how hats go on. All right. Wow, you cannot. This costume is maybe not for short people. Because I don't know if you can see what I can't see. But this, the arms are way too long. I can't even see what I'm filming right now. I wanted to do like a dance for you guys. Hopefully you can see me because I can talk. Can you see where my mouth is? But like all of my features are hidden and my hands are hidden and I can't velcro it on my body. How am I this bad at life? That's really creepy. Okay, okay, I hope this one looks good. I can't tell. The only thing that fits is the hat. Up next is one that just sounds disturbing, strange, weird, just another like how did somebody come up with this idea? I don't know. It's not a demon and it's not a horse. It's a horse demon. Now what horse ever did anything so bad that it would be like a demon, a demon horse? Horses seem really pleasant to me, super nice. I've never met a mean horse. First, I'm going to put on these gloves. Whose fingers are this long? <laughs> or is this just supposed to be part of the creepy effect? But like, look at that. Ah, come to me, my pretty. I've got fingers, really long fingers. It's like my new favorite thing though. You guys are gonna see this in my monthly favorites for October. Really weird finger gloves. Da -da 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 -da. Fingers don't fit. Oh, cause I'm trying to shove my thumb in the wrong, in the wrong place not where the thumb goes. These just like fit really weird. It's like the hand part is too short and the finger part is too long. Also, wouldn't it have made more sense for them to put in like hooves into this costume, like little plastic hoof gloves because horses don't have fingers? Somebody Photoshop that, okay? Cause I wanna see a horse with fingers. Oh, this is really itchy on the inside. I'm putting on my cloak 
to do evil deeds. This is disgusting. Look at the inside of this mask. Dude, you guys, can you see this texture? It's like bumps my gumps. It's disgusting. Okay, gotta do it for YouTube though. Gotta do it for YouTube, I don't wanna, okay. Mm. Oh boy, once again, ew. There's like stuff in here. I can't even describe it. Oh. Oh. Can you see it? Can you see it? <laughs> okay. Oh. <coughs> there was like little pieces of fuzzy fragments in there that I felt like I was breathing in. Zero visibility. So hot. No, this is the worst one we've come to yet. This is this is don't don't buy this. Don't buy it. I'm gonna try and just shove my hand in the head so that you can see the mask a little bit better. I mean, it is kind of creepy. This would be a great costume to like stick on one of those fabric dummies, you know, that you would use as a prop. But I don't know whose head would fit in there like that. Here's one that's particularly ridiculous. I definitely feel like I just breathed in something. Uh, okay, so this is. Um, first of all, the brand seems to be uh, Gorilla My Dreams. I don't know. Oh my God, I just got it. Is it supposed to be like Gorilla My Dreams? Gor gorilla My Dreams? Or like who is dreaming about gorillas? It seems really weird and obscure. Uh, so this is called Gorilla In The Midst. In The Midst. I don't think I've ever seen another Halloween costume described as in the midst. So can we get a little bit more obscure? Uh, so this costume is commemorating the scene in King Kong in which the monkey's hand is grabbing what's her face. I don't even remember that character's name, but like just how obscure of a costume is that for real? This seems like it would be a good couples costume, you know, where like, Somebody could be the girl and somebody could be like in a gorilla costume and then like, oh my God, you know, something like that. Oh, look, you guys, though, this is a look for real. Like, I feel like I can just wear this, you know, outfit of the day, coming your way, oh boy. Time to put on the gigantic monkey hand, which you just put on like a backpack, you know, convenient. Comfy. You're just wearing a hand. It doesn't, it doesn't Velcro. <laughs> it doesn't close in any way. You're just, I'm wearing a hand. I'm being grabbed by a giant gorilla. You know, like that. Um, it kind of should close in my opinion though. Like if I was gonna wear this for real, which I might, cause it's honestly hilarious. To me. I'm gonna lower the camera for this one just so you guys can get a more better look. It's kind of a cool costume. This is probably like maybe the best one we've tried on for this whole video because it does look kind of cool. It's a really, really, really silly concept, but it's kind of funny to just wear a giant King Kong hand. I'm an idiot. It does Velcro clothes. Look, and I just all over and I'm sorry giant monkey hand I don't know what this velcro is to though there's velcro on these oh you're supposed to velcro it all to one hand okay I'm an idiot so this costume is honestly great I think it was around like 50 bucks maybe a little bit more honestly I'm gonna try and link you guys to all these ridiculous costumes of course it's probably too late to be buying Halloween costumes for this year uh, but there's always next year. There was some assembly required with the next costume. So I've already put it on, but this is called Fun Mommy. I don't want to grow up. So just prepare yourself for this. Look at how obscure this costume is. This is definitely maybe the weirdest one so far. Uh, so it's kind of dying on me. This costume had two inflatable parts that I just had to blow up. So the mother body is like inflatable and strapped to my chest. 
And then there are supposed to be like some baby legs. Can you see my, my baby butt back here? This was supposed to have inflatable legs in it, but unfortunately it came with a freaking hole in the baby butt legs. Look at how horrific this like mother face looks. This is like scary. I'm just a little baby. I'm just a little baby. Back. Oh, oh I just like turned my ankle. Moment of silence. Um, it looks like. Oh, I just my butt just wiggled out of my diaper. Okay. Mm. This one was a challenge. The next costume is gonna be like M Night Shyamalan, and it's gonna have. A twist! Because it's a costume that should not be horrifying, yet somehow it is. The next costume is a panda. Just think like, oh, bunny, how can a panda be weird? Well, because somehow it can look like this. I guess this is what the pandas must look like in hell, because this is not a normal, not a normal panda costume. Get out of the bag. Get out of the bag. Ooh, look at all the fur. I also would like to point out that this was $188. It is very fluffy, and I think it's gonna be way too big for me, but I'm gonna put it on anyway. I'm too short for everything. Once again, I'll reiterate the fun fact. I'm five foot three, so most things like onesies and stuff are too long in the legs for me. Oh, there's little panda hands. Hi guys, hi. Looks good, doesn't it? Looks great. Also, there's a tail, a tail, 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 tail. horrifying. I don't even know if you can hear me. Hi. How are you doing today? Welcome to the panda show where everything is super duper horrifying. <laughs> okay. Mm. I can actually kind of see out of this one though. So this one is honestly not that bad. It's like if you want to be something that uh, you know, shouldn't be creepy, but you just that kind of person, you just wanna make everything creepy, go ahead, that's a costume for you. Up next, we're gonna be engaging earthworm. Ha ha ha. You guys, I feel like I should do a follow me around in this video. I feel like I should do a follow me around in this video. I feel like I should do a follow me around uh, video wearing this costume because it's perfect. You know, I mean, this one is really weird still. Still really weird. Oh, they give you earthworm foots. Oh, this is magical. Okay, I'm gonna sit up here. Woo! Bought this one, honestly, for my own personal enjoyment uh, because it's funny to me and I like earthworms. I think earthworms are one of nature's finest creations. Ah, uh, look, even the foots, the foots, they're pointy. The toes are pointy. Can you guys tell? Can you guys tell? Or does it just look pointy because I'm pointing my toes? This costume is not for the claustrophobic. I'm not claustrophobic, but this costume is making me claustrophobic. Oh my God, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Ah! What do you do when you're home alone and you get stuck in an earthworm costume? This is like in space. No one can hear you scream. Okay. For some reason, there's a tag on my head. What's going on here? All right. Oh, and it's choking me. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I feel like I'm really close 
So some kind of breakthrough, a breakthrough or a breakdown. One or the other is gonna happen. I'm gonna have to stuff the head with something though, cause this is a very tragic looking earthworm, you know? Um, okay, now I'm trying to shimmy down into my earthworm body. Shimmy down into my earthworm body. My feet are just dragging and you guys can't see. There's no, I can't. Okay, this tag has got to go. Yeah! Okay. I finally live the dream. I am a giant, giant earthworm. I'm gonna try and, all oh, my legs are stuck together. I'm trying to hop up, but I can't. Can you guys see, there's a long tail. Yeah, it's a good look. Living the dream. I'm trying to be an earthworm right now, but it's not. I don't think this is how earthworms, whoa! I'm an earthworm, oh boy. Yeah, I'm gonna try and roll off now without, without dying. Oh, okay. Oh, this is hot. Can you imagine though, if I went in public looking like this? I definitely, you know, if you're gonna get this costume, be prepared to fill the top of the worm up with newspaper or something because it's just not doing it. Okay, oh, I've gotta get out of this. How? Oh, I forgot to zip it up. Look, it's like I'm trying to become a butterfly. Ah, all right. Ooh, that was too much. Ah, okay, and my ponytail is slowly dying. I'm gonna have you guess. I'm gonna have you guys guess. This is part of the next costume. Can you guess what this might be? The next costume is gonna take three minutes to assemble. Did you guess yet? Is this helping? You're not seeing all of it. This is my first inflatable costume that I've ever had. I'm a person bathing. I'm in a bathtub. Once again, this is a really, really, really weird costume. Who's like, yeah. I want to be a, a bathing person. Show everyone how clean I am. <laughs> this poor duck, just being shook to death. This kind of inflates like surprisingly well though. And this is definitely the coolest costume I've put on. Cause there is like a little fan blowing on my legs. This shower cap is kind of freaking me out though, honestly. Ew. It left a line on my head. Ugh, okay. <coughs> they should put a squeaker in the duck. You know, I'm just crushing, just crushing the poor little duck. All the little knobs aren't inflating. There they go. You know, it can't be perfect, right? You might be saying to yourself, Bunny, I loved the last costume. I wanna look like I'm a super clean person, but I'm not a bath taking person. I'm a shower person, so don't worry. I got you covered here with the shower curtain. I think it's more just like a person taking a shower. It's, it's very late at night. I'm gonna be honest with you guys and let you know it is 3 a.m. Uh, so some assembly was required, you know, like any good Halloween costume. So now I have to figure out how to strap this harness onto my body here. This isn't looking like it's gonna work out so well. This is a great costume. I'm so happy I paid $49.99 for this. This part around you, like a really weird belt. Maybe there's like a leg part. I don't know, you know? Okay, this is clearly not for the arms. Oh, you know what? I bet this is for like your upper torso. This is too complicated. Do, do you guys get the, do you? Do you? Are you seeing? Once again, maybe this is for a tall person, because I don't know. Look, we'll put it like that. I look like a really lame superhero. I'm Shower Girl. It doesn't get any better the more I try and do it. You know? Oh, it fell apart. Imagine that. Let me look at the picture again. Yeah! What's going on here? He's wearing it like I just tried to put it on. And somehow the shower head is all the way up here on him. It's not working out for me. Am I missing a piece in this costume? 
Or am I just not tall enough? But who is that tall? Seriously. Is this for tall people only? Hey, you guys. Oh, no, 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 no. Thought I was fixing it. Just broke it. Okay, don't buy that. It's really weird anyway. You know, world, world's weirdest. But we're at the grand finale and we're at my favorite costume. I saved the best for last. Okay, um, also sippy sippy. I'm so excited. Okay, so this costume is Big Baby Mad Hatter. So you can be a big, giant, crying baby. This is gonna be horrifying, exciting, all of the things. I hope that this doesn't have any inflatable pieces because after blowing up that mother baby costume, that was, that was something else. This is how I put on the clothes, on my clothes, on my clothes, on my clothes, on my clothes. Okay. Uh, now time for the big giant head. I don't know how you see through this, possibly. Oh, it's another one of those. Oh, you guys. I can't see through this really well. Is this genuinely horrifying? I hope that it is. So I guess this is supposed to be like the top of the baby bonnet. I don't know if that's clear. And you're just a big giant horrifying baby face in your stomachal area. And then you've got feet. I've got feet. I'm a happy little baby. But I don't look very happy. I look kind of sad. And I look kind of angry. Oh, that doesn't work to sit. Ugh, okay. I'm trying to get the tongue to. Is that doing anything for you? Uh, I'm just a little baby. I'm just a little baby. When I grow up. I'm making really creepy. I'm trying to make this creepy. Is it creepy? Uh, kiss the baby. Kiss the baby. I kiss the baby. Okay. It's really hot like all the other ones. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching. Of course, this was a really long video because I feel like world's weirdest it's always a really, really long video to film because I always overbuy and I get too, too many weird things. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and a lot of y'all have been asking in the comments and absolutely yes, I'm going to be making my annual treat bag video to show you guys what I'm going to be putting in the treat bags that I hand out to all the trick or treaters that come to my house. I think I've done that every single year on YouTube and I will continue to do it every single year on YouTube. So look forward to that. Leave a comment down below. Let me know which costume you thought was the weirdest, which one you thought was the creepiest. I'm excited to know. I want to know. Uh, thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you're not already and you'd like to be, hit that button down below. Subscribe. Become a member of the Swamp Family and give an alligator its wings. Also, if you want, you can like me on Facebook, facebook.com slash graveyardgirl, or you can follow me on Twitter, Tumblr, or Instagram at graveyardgirl. Same way it's spelled here. Also, uh, leave me some suggestions down below of what you would like to see the world's weirdest of. What should we do next time? Like world's weirdest blank. Leave me a comment down below and I will try and find a bunch of products to correlate with that theme and we will test it out. I love you guys so, so much and I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye!